Hi everyone, um, so today with it being Father's Day, I just wanted to share a quick thought I had um, since it's my first Father's Day. And I don't know what that means for you, you know, you might have a really good relationship with your dad and you might be spoiling them today or you might just let him watch the footy um, in peace for once. But some of you, I know, um, you might not even know your dads or if you do know your dads, they might not be a very good guy um, and you might have a bad relationship. And if that is you, I am really sorry for that. Um, but I wanted to tell us all about um, God as our father in the Bible. Now, um, in the last five months or so, I've been really thinking about um, what it means to be a father. And I'm so conscious of all the different ways I can let Jackson down. So I might get tired, I might get a bit angry, I might get a bit selfish, um, which I think every one of us who's a father does sometimes. But actually, it says in the Bible that God doesn't get any of those things. God is perfect and God's love for you lasts forever. Um, so I don't know what you're thinking this t uh, today. I don't know how you're taking Father's Day. It might be a really good day, it might be a really bad day. You might just not care. Um, but I want you to know today that God is your perfect father. There's love for you will never stop. And all you have to do is reach out for him and he will um, reach back out for you.